is time for another Moving Diaries. My apologies that it's been quite some time since the last time I updated you guys on the apartment, but as you can see by the looks of it, there has been so many upgrades, so many additions, and I am so excited to share them all with you guys. Before I give you guys the current, current update, let's go back a few weeks and recap everything we've missed so far. By the way, if you don't know who I am, my name is Fernanda. Welcome to my channel. Make sure to subscribe because I have a whole bunch of other videos like this one that are part of my Moving Diaries, and I have more to come. So, without further ado, let's get on into it. If you've watched my content the past few weeks, you've definitely seen some sneak peeks, but just to give you guys an update on what's been happening behind the scenes, I did get this wonderful rug to go under my couch. It's just white and it is from Costco. As you can see here, I am struggling to lift this up, but luckily I had the help of my parents, which I am so, so grateful for. And then my dad helped me build this cabinet. I believe it's from Ikea and I do really like it, although I think it's a little bit low. So I think we might add like a little platform on the bottom just so that it's higher than my dining room table. But it's great because it has lots of storage and it looks super cute. Then we got this package from Wayfair. This is where I plan for it to go. Okay, we just put up this wall shelf thing up and honestly, I think I might've ordered the wrong one. I swear I ordered it white and gold, but it came here and it's like marble and gold. You guys can let me know in the comments what you think. I think it's too late, honestly, to like return it. I don't know, but I just, I don't know if this is the vibe. It's very like modern, sophisticated, mature, not very like Pinterest pastel, but I think I could fix that up with my decorations. So this is what it looks like. I don't think it's bad or anything. And I think it still matches. I'm just not sure what the vibe is. I also love how this one, matches this one this is from ikea this is kind of what it looks like from afar i also added a little hanging plant this is from ikea but i definitely need to put it in a pot to make it a lot cuter and i'm really excited to start filling this up with little trinkets It's been so long since I've done anything to do with the moving series because I went on so many trips. I hadn't been able to order any furniture for like the longest time because I wasn't gonna be here and then blah, blah, blah. But finally, we've got our three last pieces. We've got two mirrors, a chair. We've still got some little things to do, adding stuff here and there, but for the most part, furniture is done. Woo! -hoo! I'm so going crazy. I slept so late last night. We're not gonna set this up yet. We are going to open some packages. Fernando received a bunch of Nova Beauty. Nova Beauty. Liquid highlighters. This one is <laughs> copper. Oh, oh, this one's bronze though. What one did you use? It's not deep. deep bronze. <laughs> this is for pets. Let me show you. Oh, look. look. It's a hammock for the wall. What? Like you attach it to the window. Cool. Oh, okay. A beauty brush. Oh, it's kind of like an angle. Oh, it's oh. so soft. <laughs> Okay, this package I'm excited for. This is CB2. I think I ordered like a decent amount of like little things. What was like, what do we got going on? Oh my gosh, you have so many little things. The environment right now is quaking. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Wait, these are really nice. Those are real cute. I haven't been to a proper winery yet, so I wasn't sure or which one. But they have so many different shades. These are really nice. Yeah, like the big ones, like yeah. that wine. Ooh. Oh, 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 honey. honey. I needed it for like the brunch. You needed it for your brunch. And me buying all my things I buy, it's like for that event that one day will happen. And I have a brunch. That's really that's so cute. It's so cute. It's so cute. The easiest drink I feel like to make, honestly, is like an espresso martini. Those are so pretty. What? These are okay, next item. Is this like a little box? Oh, I think I bought that for my vanity. Okay, this is so cute. So this is from Amazon. It's like a little tray. I was debating between getting like an actual bar cart, but I didn't. On this day, I got a few packages delivered to my door and luckily I had my two girlies with me, Shaylee and Elena. They were so sweet to come help me today and we just spent the day building a bunch of furniture and they were just so awesome. Honestly, I love them so much. Here we are building this chair. It is from Structube and it's super fluffy and it's like a Sherpa material, so I love it. While Elena did this, I started with these frames and opening them up and putting the prints in. The frames were from Ikea and the prints were from Etsy, although they were a little bit too big so I had to go in myself and cut them, which was kind of annoying, but it ended up up looking super cute. Okay, grand reveal. Bam. Yay. You can have the first set. We built it. No, she's just like, <laughs> it falls <laughs> <off>. <laughs> I'm like, thank you. I'd never do that again. Yay. Let's see her. Hi. So vintage. She's gorgeous. Okay. She's 
she's cute, she's cute. These were from Structube and I really like them. I like this vintage gold vibe and it matches kind of the theme of my apartment with the gold. Then this tray, I am obsessed with the look of this. This is to kind of replace the bar cart that I didn't do, but I added these like cute little glass details and I love the way it looks. Then here we have Elena, she's being a babe and helping me build this thing that you can suction to the wall where your cat can go up there. And then I opened up a night table that I got from CB2, but unfortunately it was broken and I'm so upset about this. It looks your first. Uh oh. Damage. Look at it. There. We just opened this and it's like super scratched and like, I don't know how that happened because it's like on the sides too. So, very, very interesting. Oopsies. <laughs> no, it's okay. Not everything can go through. Not there. everything can go through. Well, whatever. But what can you do? This could have been cute though. Kind of random. This was supposed to be my side table. <laughs> Okay, next thing we got is the parachute bedding. It's gonna be like hopefully really cozy bed. It's like literally linen. It's exciting. It's super exciting. I've heard lots of good things about this. Apparently it's supposed to feel like a hotel bed, like the Shangri-La bed. I love that. I have white too. We have a third. Like the blue like this guy who on Whatever. Tell me it's nice. It's nice. It's really nice. I love it. It's so nice. Someone's gonna ream you out for not washing the sheets. Oh, you're totally, you're totally right. You're totally right. Maybe just cut out the middle part of all the wrapping. <laughs> Get rid of all the wrapping. <laughs> yeah, cut out the wrapping. Get out the factory. <laughs> it doesn't even Like not giving, but you know what? It's white, it's cute. I Yay! love it. I'm so excited to sleep in this mm -hmm. bed. Do you want to lay on it? Give it a test. <laughs> you, okay, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> 10 out of 10, how much do you rate it? I rate this a 9.4. Yeah, it's improvement. I rate this a 11. I'm Yay! so sleeping. I'm in just kidding. This is yeah, guys, I'm paying you guys. Same with yeah. you. Same with you. Same Honestly, Fred, I think that this needs a. I think. <laughs> We have so many boxes since we unboxed everything with my friends yesterday and today my parents are coming to my house so that's gonna be great. We're gonna continue cleaning, so let's get to it. Over and they brought Mishu, my cat, and I know you guys have been asking when I'm gonna have him in my apartment, and I guess today's the day, so we're gonna see how he reacts. He's never been to my apartment before, and he's also a really weird cat. Like, he gets anxious and, like, mad really easily, so let's see how he does. Mishu, what's happening? Mishu, what is happening? He's so confused. Someone brought to my house a rainbow cake, but there was no no and it's for one million So we have no clue who brought it for us. By the way, I did not mean to sound so nonchalant about the fact that we just hit one million I don't want to go too in-depth with it because I literally have a full video on it But the video is gonna go up after this video So I'm mentioning that I hit one million without properly mentioning it on my YouTube channel moral of the story There's a video coming out. There's gonna be a giveaway soon. I'm so excited Thank you for one million though 
I'm so excited for that video. Just wait for that video, okay? I love you guys. I love you guys. Mm, I can't handle it. Look at how nice it looks. This is all that it says. He doesn't know how to act. We're gonna cut the cake, although it has no note, and so somebody did warn me that it could be like poisonous, but we're gonna open it anyways. Hey. The cake is beautiful. Thank you for the person who sent it. That's so beautiful! Ooh. Wow, my goodness. We have to eat it. <laughs> this is so beautiful. <laughs> I should have made a TikTok of me opening it. Yes. It's too late now. No, look at it. This is rainbow cake. Okay, so I'm on my computer right now. You can kind of see a little bit of my office, but pretend you don't see that. I'm eating an ice cream. It's mango sorbet. But from Amazon, I ordered these acrylic floating bookshelves because I want to put magazines in them. I think that'll be super cool for something. I think probably for my room, I can put like maybe like Vogue magazines. I think that would be epic. I also bought this three tier ceramic hanging pot planter indoor wall plant pot holder for succulent herbs. I was thinking of putting this in my kitchen and putting like succulents in it just because I want a little bit more green in there. I also bought this little like shoe rack from Structu. I want to buy this magazine rack. I think it would look super cool next to the little chair that I have in the living room now. Again, filling it up with like magazines, preferably Vogue or like something kind of cool. I'm trying to think of what else there is that I can show you guys. This is what my mirror looks like once it's mounted up on my wall. And yeah, that's basically my apartment up to date other than the office. It is now September. I've been living alone since May. May, June, July, August, September. I'm gonna give it four months ish, three and a half, three and three quarters. I don't even know how much because I've been traveling a lot. So a lot of the time I wasn't here, but it has, it's just, there's been so many ups and so many downs. And I'm honestly really scared for winter to approach because it's gonna be so terrifying. And I can already kind of feel it because the weather is getting like not ideal. Anyways, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and enjoyed the update. Like I said, there is much more to come. So I hope you guys are staying tuned and are subscribed. And make sure you follow my TikTok and my Instagram as well because I am posting on there literally daily. But yeah, I love you guys. I have so much on the way. I hope you're doing well. Comment this emoji. I'm eating candy, by the way. But comment this emoji if you made it till the end. And I will see you guys in the comments. Backyard of your old farm in the summer